I genuinely can't remember ever meeting you. I just don't remember anyone ever being like, this is Jack. <laughs> I don't ever remember anyone being like, this is Jack. Can you remember any early memories of me? How long do you think we've actually known of each other? I think I've known of you for a while. I think your reputation precedes you. What would be the perfect ingredients for a night out? I'd quite like to be in some flat shoes. Clever. Would be going somewhere that I never usually go. A spontaneous night where I kind of think I'm going to be in my pajamas and I end up just being like whisked away. It's better for me to not have a lot of time. Sometimes when you have a lot of time by yourself, you can go slightly crazy. But I find the more comfy my outfit is, the more confident I am. And maybe the more fun you have. Definitely. I wanted to talk to you about mixing up on a night out. I want to go somewhere where I can play, entertain my inner child. I mean, I've had some nights out where I just laughed so much. <laughs> That's the best, when you laugh yourself silly. Mm. <laughs> so we... <laughs> You're always very together, I think. Yeah. Like, whenever I see you, you always look amazing. How important is it to you to, like, stay looking like that throughout an evening? I'm quite lucky that I know my limits. And you're so busy that you can't kind of lose a day to a hangover. You're a classy bird, is what I'm trying to say. I don't know about classy bird, but um, I'm quite, like, self-aware and, I, you know, I need to... You can't be a silly Suki. I can't be a silly Suki too much. <laughs> I've got to get myself home and I've got to wake up the next morning and, and get on with it.